Hello guys, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you today? How was your weekend? Good Fine. Evening. All good. All right. Gio, hello. Jorge, yeah. Hi. welcome to another class here at Inglés Corporativo. My name is Alejandro Narbona. And today we will be practicing some, we will be reviewing some of the topics that we covered previously and also learning some new topics. All right. So, guys, how was homework? How were the knowledge, the previous knowledge checks about describing people? It's, it's awful because it's a little confused for me. <laughs> Understood. Don't worry. Don't worry. We all feel that way at some point. At some point. Yes. All right. Um, but remember, practice makes perfect, Jorge. Yeah. Okay. All right. So, which is the one that was difficult for you? We were supposed to do 4.6, right? Uh, for me, uh, the, my problem is, or my problem are, uh, mix the tenses for the exercise. Uh, when I use does or when I use do, for example, and the, make the question with WH word. Okay. All right. I understand. So, guys, could you please help by mentioning when do we use do and when do we use does? Yes, uh, I use does when the third person and the past tense and do when it is a simple person. Exactly, simple person. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So we're going to use do with the subjects. What are the subjects for do, guys? I. I. They. We. We. Uh -huh. I. You. We. You, they. 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 And what are the subjects for do? For does, my apologies. He, she, he, she, she is. Mm -hmm. He, she, she is. is. Correct. Now, with this one, Jorge, Ronnie, um, I know that at the beginning it's a little bit difficult, but it's like going to the gym. The first days at the gym, you cry. Because it's very difficult. You're not used the first, to The first week, not the... <laughs> yeah. The first week, the first month is difficult. The first two months... Yeah, difficult. Why? Because you gotta change everything: your lifestyle, uh, the time that yeah. you dedicate to your family. But let me tell you, it's worth it. Vale la pena, guys. So, practice makes perfect. Um, and also, Jorge, uh, lo que usted estaba diciendo acerca de que cuesta a veces para mezclar. Le entiendo. I understand. That is totally normal. ¿Cómo lo vamos a hacer? Practicing with people. And practicing every single day all right so we help each other now um, let's go ahead and review exercise 4.6 the knowledge check about the questions mm -hmm. 4.6 is everybody in the platform yes yes all right I'm not gonna share the screen because I already have the answers okay so I don't want to show you the answer. Number one, the answer will be my brother is 26 years old. What's the question, guys? How old is your brother? How old? Mm -hmm. How old is your brother? And at the beginning, I got them all wrong because I was typing the question mark and the question, question mark. mark is already there. Yeah. So I thought, wait, what? It was a little confusing at the beginning. All right, next one. I am 173 centimeters or I am 173. What is the question? How tall, how tall are you? Mm -hmm. How tall are you? How tall are you? And how in this tall are you? With the WH questions, remember that we go down in pitch. So we don't say how tall are you? We say how tall are you? And we go down in pitch. How tall are you? How tall are you? Everyone, repeat it with me. How tall are you? How tall are you? How old is your brother? How old is your brother? How old is your brother? Correct. So we go down. Next one. Sharon has brown hair. What's the question? What color is Sharon's hair? What color is Sharon's hair? What color is Sharon's hair? Sharon's, Sharon's, Sharon's hair. hair. Sharon's hair. Let me go ahead and copy it. 
and Tell a them. question mark. Mm -hmm. I'm typing it on the chat. Next one. No, she doesn't. She wears she contact, contact lenses. Contact. What's the question? Does she wear glasses? Mm -hmm. She wear glasses. Excellent and very nice intonation. You go up in pitch. Next one. The answer. He's tall and very good looking. What does he look like? What does he look like? Does he look like? How? 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 What does? How? What does? How does? What does? Like? does what? Like. Oh, this is correct. What does he look mm. like? I would use how. If you type in what and and it's accepted, I think you can use both. But in my own personal opinion, I would use how. How? Mm -hmm. How? Right. How does? Exactly. I what like what? In the platform is correct. <laughs> yes, yes. Mm -hmm. es, es lo que estoy diciendo, que se lo puede aceptar porque sí se puede hacer así. Yo no me mal, pero how does he look? Like? How? Mm -hmm. does. But how again, does. that's like my personal thing. Next one. Okay. I have dark brown eyes. My, is my sister Harry is a medium black. The six. Oh, sorry. The six. Yeah. You're right. So what will what, what, what the question be? How long is your sister's hair? Mm -hmm. How long is your sister's hair? And again, we go down in pitch. I have dark brown eyes. What color are your eyes? Mm -hmm. What color are your eyes? Your eyes. Your eyes. You get it here. Next one. I'm 40 years old. How old are you? How old are you? Uh -huh. And we go down in pitch again. How old are you? How old are you? How old are you? Uh -huh. Are you? We go down in pitch. Are you? Are, are you? you? Good job. The next one. They are nice, beautiful, and very tall. How what do they, do they look, like? look like? Mm -hmm. How or what do they look like? Again, what do they look like? Mm -hmm. Can be either or. And the last one. He is one eighty. How tall is he? How tall is he? There you go. So you see, he, guys, you don't you don't even need my help. You're good on this thing. So congratulations, guys. Thank you. Can you repeat the last one? Absolutely. Can anybody help me and repeat the last one, please? How tall is he? How tall is he? How tall is he? How tall is he? Thank you. You're welcome. All right, very good. So now let's get down to business. Do you know what is that the, the meaning of that expression? Let's go down to business. Let's go down to business. Let's get, I'm writing Let's down, get, down right. to business. Let's write down to business. A lo que hemos venido. Exacto. A lo que hemos venido. Démosle con todo. All right. So I'm going to be sharing the screen. So we will start here. Let's go down, down. Let's go down to business. Let's get down to business. All right. So here you're able to see my screen. Is everybody able to see my screen? Yes. 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 Fantastic. So read it with me. Lesson objective. Lesson, lesson, lesson objective. objective. Lesson objective. In this session, you will listen to a dialogue. In this session, you will listen to a dialogue. You will listen to a dialogue. Uh-huh. That's good. 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 You see, here's where we get the pronunciation. Say it with me. Session. Remember, I'm not sure if I already explained this. No sé si ya les expliqué esto. Cuando tenemos la I-O-N, el fonema prácticamente sería So, como que pasemos de directamente a la N. Exactly. So, mucha gente a veces se le va la O. Session, abre la boca. Y aquí tendríamos que tener acá. I don't know if you can see my screen, but it's session. 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 Mm -hmm. session. The next one, session. I heard some issues here. This one, dialogue. 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 Mm -hmm. Say it with me. Dialogue. 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 Mm -hmm. dialogue. In this session, you will listen to a dialogue. In this, in this session, session we we'll listen to a dialogue. 
Mm -hmm. Dialogue. I need a volunteer to read. In this okay. session, you will listen to a dialogue. To a dialogue. Good, good, good. Dialogue. Dialogue. Where two people use modifiers with participles and prepositions. Where two, two people two use, use modifiers, modifiers with the prepositions and prepositions. All right, there we go. Let's go with the pronunciation here. People. 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 Mm -hmm. people. In this one, people. we really don't pronounce the O. We don't say people. people. We say people. 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 Mm -hmm. people. Say it with me. Playa. 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 So we're going to say people, people. like playa. People. 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 Mm -hmm. people. Exactly. people. Next one. Modifiers. 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 Participles. Participles. And again, aquí vemos que se repite un poquito. Igual que. Participles. Como playa. Participles. Participles. And the next one. Prepositions. 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 Otra vez. Prepositions. 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 Mm -hmm. Prepositions. Very good. Now, pronunciation is very important, guys, but don't worry about it because we only have, there are 26 letters. All right. I 26 letters. Y hay 39 fonemas. Okay. 40 si metemos la, la Y, la Y, que a veces es consonante y a veces es vocal. Alright, so no es mucho lo que tenemos que aprender. Este es un ejemplo excelente cuando vemos que dos fonemas, por ejemplo este, el I o N, se empiezan a repetir, ¿verdad? Y también el T. Y vemos que ambos se repiten. Si nosotros los empezamos a dominar, luego todo es bajada, alright? So, say this with me. In this session, you will listen to a dialogue where two people use modifiers with participles and prepositions. And this will listen to two people using modifiers with prepositions and prepositions. All right, very good. I need a volunteer, guys. Me, teacher. All right, go ahead. In this session, you will listen to a dialogue where two people using modifiers with the participles and prepositions. Very good. I vamos. There you go. Good job. Good job. Good job. I don't clap because I have a microphone in front of me. It's going to be very noisy. All right. So, en esta clase escucharán un diálogo entre dos personas, las cuales usan modificadores con participios y preposiciones. All right. So, everybody, please mute your microphones. Let's go ahead and mute your microphones. And I'm going to stop sharing so I can share with audio. Hello, nice to have you back. In this lesson, you will listen to a conversation where two people use modifiers with participles and prepositions. As you listen to the conversation, try to identify, identify the use of participles and prepositions. In the next video, we will teach you how and when to use each. Hi, Raul. Good to see you. Where's Maggie? Oh, she couldn't make it. She went to a concert with Alex. Oh, well, why don't you go and talk to Julia? She doesn't know anyone here. Julia? Which one is she? Is she the woman wearing glasses over there? No, she's the tall one in jeans. She's standing near the window. Oh, I'd like to meet her. All right. Is she the woman wearing glasses? There we go. So please go ahead and unmute your microphones. Because we're going to work with some vocabulary and uh, pronunciation. All right, say it with me. Hi, Raul. Hi, Raul. Hi, Raul. 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 Good to see you. 
Good to see you. Good to see you. See you. Mm -hmm. Good to see you. Good to see you. Good to see you. What is the meaning of good to see you? Good to see you. Qué bueno verte. Qué bueno verte, exactly. Where's Maggie? Where's Maggie? Maggie. Maggie. Oh, she couldn't make it. Oh, oh, she, oh couldn't she couldn't make, make it. Make it. Couldn't. Mm -hmm. couldn't. This one right here, we're going to say couldn't. 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 Mm -hmm. couldn't what is the meaning of she couldn't make it? No, no lo logro. Uh -huh. um, mm -hmm. Literalmente sería como no lo logro. No, no puedo venir. Mm -hmm. puedo venir. Exactly, exactly. That's what we do. If, for example, someone is sick and someone is in the hospital and you say she couldn't make it, it means that the person died. Since yeah. the person desafortunadamente falleció, no sobrevivió, no sobrevivió, no logró, estiró la pata, etc. Et et <laughs> <laughs> so, but when we're talking about any other context, no vino, mm -hmm. um, no pudo hacer la tarea, espero que no sea su caso, we can say, I couldn't make it, she couldn't make it. So it, it depends on the context. In, the context. In this context, it will be, no pudo venir. All right? So let's right. continue. She went to a concert with Alex. She went to, she went she went to, to a concert, concert with, with, with Alex. Alex. To a concert with Alex. With Alex. With, with Alex. 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 Good. With Alex. Sure with Alex. Alex. Even though I cannot it's hear Alex. you all, I, I'm starting to recognize some voices. And if I recognize a mistake, I can help you fix it. Okay? okay. So here, let's try to link everything. And we say, she went to a concert with Alex. She went, she to, went to a concert with Alex. Oh, well, why don't you go and talk to Julia? Oh, oh well, well, why don't you go and talk to Julia? Julia. Why don't you? Why don't you? Why don't you? Explode it. Try to copy what I say. Why don't you? Why don't you? Why don't you? Why don't you? Why don't you go and talk to Julia? Why don't you go and talk to Julia? And why don't you go and talk to Julia? All right, very good. So here we have two things that we need to link. Why don't you? Why don't you? Talk to. Talk to. Talk to. Why don't you go and talk to Julia? Why don't you go and talk to Julia? Good job. She doesn't know anyone here. She doesn't know anyone here. We go again. She doesn't know anyone here. She doesn't, she doesn't know anything. Anyone here? All right, anyone very good. Here. So, what is the meaning of why don't you? Por qué no vas? Por qué no vas? Ajá, por qué no? How do you say, por qué no estudias? Mañana tenés examen. Why don't you study tomorrow? Why don't you study? Why don't you study? Exactly, why don't you study? Um, por qué no vas a la tienda a comprar una bebida? Why don't you go to the grocery store? All right, what is the meaning of she doesn't know anyone here? Okay, and can I say she doesn't know someone here? Well, yeah. she doesn't know someone. She doesn't know someone. She doesn't know someone. Mm -hmm. no she doesn't anybody. know nobody. She doesn't no. know anybody. All right. Anybody. So what happened here, here, guys? No podemos ocupar someone, okay? Porque someone generalmente lo ocupamos para contestar. En anyone lo ocupamos para negativos y preguntas. Y aquí está en negativo. Okay. All right. Y también podemos ver el hecho. ¿Cuál es el otro? Permítanme. Alguien dijo, she doesn't, and you know, make a, um, she doesn't know nobody. Mm, okay, someone is asking for an example. For, an example? Because you, you, told, you tell the, the anyone is mm -hmm. only for a, a, a positive. Uh, for negative, for negative. For negative, for negative. Plans, sorry, sorry, for negative. Mm -hmm. you can, do the, can you make an example for an uh, um, affirmative? Um, yeah, she knows someone. 
Ella conoce a alguien. She knows someone. She knows someone. For example, she knows nobody here. And that's the other one. That's the other one. Remind me, Ronnie, please. So, in the previous one, did I answer your question? Was that a good example for you? Anyone is a negative and someone is a affirmative. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Affirmative. These are um, pronouns. Okay. Y esto lo vamos okay. a ver más adelante. We're going to cover this uh, later on today. Anyone sería como nadie. Okay. Y yeah. someone sería alguien. Alguien. Mm -hmm. We gotta say someone porque nosotros no podemos mezclar afirmativo con nadie. No podemos decir ella conoce a nadie o él conoce a mm -hmm. nadie. So that's why we use she doesn't know anyone. Anyone. Ella no conoce a nadie. And she knows someone. Ella conoce a alguien. Okay. Mm -hmm. And that's why we go um, negative in questions with any and the other ones in affirmative. And the other one, Ronnie, what did you say? She does know nobody. Okay, very good. Here. Eso también lo vamos a ver más adelante, pero solo para que sepan. That will be a double negative. Eso es un doble negativo. Si decimos, she doesn't, ella no. She doesn't know no one. Es como que tenemos dos negativos. No, no she one. doesn't, negative. No one. No, no. Pega. no. Negative. Como, como en matemáticas, menos y menos. Más por más. Uh -huh. Exactly, and vice versa. But we'll cover that. No. So let's continue. Julia. 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 Which one is she? Which, Which one, is, one, she? one is, is she? Is she the woman wearing glasses over there? Is she the woman wearing she glasses, wearing glasses, wearing glasses, glasses over, there? over there? What is the meaning of over there? Por allá, por allá. Por allá, por allá. Exactly. All right. And what is the meaning of, is she the woman wearing glasses over there? Ella es la, la mujer que está usando glasses, eh, lentes, por allá. Por allá. There you go. Es la que no, está she's the tall one in jeans. No, no she's the tall one, 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 one in jeans. jeans. Mm -hmm. And what is the meaning of that sentence? No, la es la de pantalones. Exactly, in jeans. Pantalones vaqueros. She's standing near the window. She's standing She's near, standing the, near the, window. the window. She's standing near the window. Meaning of that one? She's está parada frente a la ventana. Parada cerca de la ventana. Cerca, cerca de la ventana. Cerca de la ventana. All right. Oh, I'd like to meet her. Oh, oh I'd like I to meet her. I'd like to meet her. I'd. I'd like Me gustaría. And me gustaría. Is, you can explain to me why we have I apostrophe D. I would. I would like. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> I would like. Me gustaría. All right, guys. So this is why it's important for you to log into every single class because I always try to give you more information and tip that can help you with your learning process, all right? Por eso es que es muy importante que se conecten porque de una, de una conversación corta podemos sacar pronunciación, vocabulario y otros temas que les puedan servir. So, thank you very much for logging in tonight. Now, let's go with the next one. Lesson objective. In this session, we will learn to use modifiers with participles and prepositions. In this session, we will learn to use modifiers with participles and prepositions. Very good. I need a volunteer to read the objective, please. In this session, we will learn to use modifiers with participles and prepositions. Good job, good job, sir. Thank you very much. Now, en esta clase aprenderemos cómo usar modificadores con preposición, con participios en preposiciones y preposiciones. All right. So, let's go ahead and share this one real quick. Everyone, please mute your microphone. Hello again. In this session, we will understand and use modifiers with participles and prepositions. Modifiers with participles and prepositions. Who's Raul? Participles. He's the man wearing a green shirt. Which one is Raul? He's the one talking to Liz. 
Who's Liz? Prepositions. She's the woman with short black hair. Which one is Julia? She's the tall one in jeans. Who are the Smiths? They're the people next to the window. Which ones are the Smiths? They're the ones on the couch. When we use modifiers with participles, this is how we use them. A participle is used before a noun and they modify it. They finish with ing, but they are not verbs. They are adjectives. Notice we use prepositions along with more information to modify the noun. In this case, the noun woman. When we use modifiers with prepositions, they go after a noun. All right, guys. Confusing or easy? Yes. So, 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 so. All right. So let's make it easy then. Now, I'm going to explain this to you real quick. All right. We can say, who's Raul? Quien es Raul? Who's, Raul? Quien es Raul? who's Liz? Who's Gio? Who's, who's Xiomara? Who's Ronnie? Okay. And we can say, he is or she is the man, the, man. the woman, mm -hmm. okay? Generalmente vamos a ocupar esos dos. The man, the woman, el hombre, la mujer, wearing a green shirt, que está usando camisa verde. All right? So, con los participios, vamos a decir de quién estamos hablando, okay? Y luego mm. ponemos más información con las preposiciones. All right. So, generalmente nosotros hacemos esta en español. ¿Y de quién me estás hablando? El chiquito que está allá. Mm. Ok. ¿De quién estás hablando? <laughs> Del barejón, aquel que está allá, el alto. ¿Verdad? <laughs> so, it's the same in Spanish. ¿De quién estás hablando? El gordito. Ah, el teacher. Sí, ese. All right. So, the man, el hombre, la mujer. The one is el que está o la que está. All right? The wow. tall one, el alto o la alta. The people, la gente que está por ahí. The ones, los que están por ahí. Okay? Vamos más o menos con, los, con, con esa información? Yeah. yeah. Yes. Right. And the participles are, these are not verbs, even though you see wearing, talking, we are not actually making emphasis on the action, right? We are just pretty much describing. So, quien es, quien es Gio? Ah, Gio el que está bostezando. Sí. <laughs> right, very good. I know you're tired this Monday. <laughs> okay? And when we say el que está bostezando, no nos hacemos tanto referencia a la acción, sino que estamos describiendo. All right, so how do you say, quien es, um, quien es Leo Messi? He's the man, mm -hmm. a football player. Ajá, pero ¿cómo, cómo podemos decir que está jugando en el Barcelona? Playing. Who's the man playing, the man playing in the Barcelona? Who's the man who plays in the Barcelona? Very good. He is the man playing in Barcelona Football Club. Um, how do you say, we're talking about a burglar. Estamos hablando de un ladrón. <laughs> ¿Quién es el ladrón? Mira, ¿quién es el ladrón? Who is, man who is the man with a big bag. Uh -huh. He is the man. He's the running the over there. <laughs> wearing <mask. laughs> Okay, very good. I like that. Okay, yeah. so what can you say? We can have two types of description. Participles, que ocupamos la acción para describir qué está haciendo. Y prepositions, okay, para otra información. Las preposiciones vienen después del noun. So we can say, ¿Quién es el ladrón? Ah, el que está corriendo. How do you say that? Well, it's the man who is running over there. Ah, uh -huh. you can say, it's the man who is running. <laughs> Atrapen a Ronnie. <laughs> Ronnie, caballero. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it sounds similar. Ronnie? Running. Running. Ronnie. So? My name is with one end. <laughs> oh, exactly. It's one end, not with the last one. So, do you understand the difference? Participles, we use it to describe 
use the action that the person is doing to describe. Um, she is the man. He, he, she is the man. Ooh, look at that. And who's the boss? Who's the boss? He is the one talking to Kevin. All right. ¿Quién es la enfermera? She is the one wearing, wearing the two. White. The one. Wearing a white. How do you say bata? Cloth. Almost there, almost there. Bata, guys. Rob. R O Rob. B S N boy E. What? R. So let's look at the pictures. Who is Gio? Let's look at the pictures. <laughs> and let's use the man is wearing a blue shirt. Exactly. Where's the man? It's the man wearing a blue shirt. Who is wearing Kevin? A... Who is the man wearing a black shirt? Wearing a black shirt. Very good. Who's William? We're just using participles right now. He's the man. The mom. Wearing, wearing a, a white, white wearing shirt. shirt. Right. Right. All right. Very good. Shirt. Now let's go ahead and change the action. Who is Jorge? Who's Jorge Mendoza? Let's change the action. Man participating all class. There you go, Kevin. Good job. Kevin. Thank you so much. Good job, right? So he is the man. He is the one participating in class. Very good. So that's when we use the participles. Now what about the prepositions? And let's use Marce as an example. Guys, who is Marcela? She's a woman. Uh -huh. She's the woman. And She's the woman. <laughs> wearing a green shirt. She's wearing a red, red shirt. Okay, so we can use with. <laughs> She's is the woman. Con la camisa roja. With. She's the woman. Which. Red. red. With no, the red t-shirt wearing, wearing red shirt. Red. Correct. So, remember. Teacher, teacher, um, I can use a, she is the woman always, he is smiling. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> esa, esa es, that would be another context. Ese sería otro contexto, pero sí se puede hacer. Que es un poquito más complejo en cuanto a, a preparación. She is the woman who is always smiling. Jorge, al principio de la, de, la, de la conferencia, usted me dijo que le costaba. Y la verdad, con ese tipo de cosas me demuestra que no le cuesta. Solo tiene que darse cuenta que lo puede hacer. All right, so good job. I like that one. So, how do you say, who is Roxana? How do you say, Roxana es la que está enfrente de la... The woman. She's the woman wearing glasses. Next to the window. Next to the window. In front of the window. In front of the window. Vamos a que llegara. Oops, not this one. Give me a second. No, not this one. Not this one, this one. This one. Let's go ahead and review the prepositions, all right? In. 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 On. 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 Under. Under. Behind. Behind. Next to. Next to. In front of. In front of. Between. 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 Obviously, we have more guys, but these are the ones that we can that we can um, use. How do you say, ella es la que está detrás de María? She is behind, 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 behind Maria. Maria. Behind Maria. Behind of Maria. Behind of Maria. Behind Maria. Behind Maria. She is the one behind Maria. Um, at 2 a.m. in the morning. So how do you say él es que él es el que está durmiendo debajo de la mesa? He's the one, the one, the one under the table. Sleeping on the table. Sleeping on the table. Under table. 
Y aquí estamos metiendo las dos. Estamos ocupando el participle primero uh -huh. y luego la preposición para que las mezclemos. He is the one sleeping He's under the table. Sleeping okay. under the so, table. Doble descripción. All right. So, how do you say, also at 2, 2 a.m. in the morning, very excited in the party, how do you say, <laughs> ellos son los que están bailando sobre la mesa? They are the ones yeah. who are dancing, are the ones dancing, the ones dancing, the ones dancing on the table. On the table. Dancing on the table. On the table. On the table. Dancing on the table. Everyone say it with me. They are the ones dancing on the table. They are the ones dancing on the table. They are the ones dancing on the table. Dancing on the table. Very good. So, how do you say... Um, son las personas son las personas que están enfrente del baño. In front of the bathroom or the restroom. When it's just the bathroom, we can call it restroom. Restroom. Ahora cómo se dice ellos son las personas que están paradas enfrente del baño. They are the people, the the people, people who, who are standing in front of the restroom. The restroom. In front of the restroom. The restroom. Correct. They are the people standing in front of the restroom. In front of the restroom. In front of the restroom. Correct. All right, guys. So let's go ahead and continue with this one. Any questions about prepositions before we move on? All clear? Like I said, water, water, all clear? <laughs> yes. How do you say entre? Between. 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 Okay, between two things, right? Between. And how do you say entre, pero de un montón de gente? And between of people. Between of people. The people. Mm -hmm. Now, between, generalmente between lo vamos a ocupar entre dos entre cosas. Dos. No. Como un sándwich, right? Mm. El jamón está entre. In. Two beds. Two Pero cuando between estamos mezclados. Between the people. Cuando estamos mezclados, vamos a decir among. 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 When you use amount? Among. Among. When? among. When you are, for example, in the bus, in the 44, you are <laughs> among a lot of people. <laughs> among of people. Yeah. Not necessarily between. Between is when you have three and you are in the middle. That's between. And among is that you are there. Entre, pero por ahí. Is it clear? Yes. Yes. All right. Fantastic. So guys, let's do this. I want you to use this image we have right here as a base so you can work. And I'm gonna break the rooms. We're gonna practice for 10 minutes. Ten We're minutes. gonna use this image. So if someone can take a screenshot of it, and you're gonna be asking questions like, for example, who's Jody? Who's Eve? Who's Lucy? Okay, who are they? And you answer. Dave is the one with the white shirt. Dave is the one dancing with the white shirt, for example. Eve, who's Eve? Eve is the one talking to Helen. Eve is the one. Okay, estamos? Yeah. All right, very good. So, tratemos de sacarle la mayor cantidad de acciones que se pueda a cada imagen, a cada imagen. And I'm going to break them right now, all right? All right, there we go. Make sure you accept the invite, please. All right, I'm going to create three things. Please accept the invite. There we go. Jenny, please accept the invite. There we 
there we go let's go ahead and visit some rooms see how they're doing Don is the main is sighing with the microphone near to Clary. Okay. Uh, with that, another. that's exactly the way it is. I'm here, by the way. Any question? Let me know. I'm okay. Thank you. Continue, Jorge. Okay. Uh, Yesenia, who is Helen? Helen is, is she uh, eating pizza? She is the She's woman. The woman. Mm -hmm. She is the woman eating pizza? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, I'm fine. It's okay. okay. Good. Um, what else? Tratan de sacarle el jugo a todas las que pueda. She is the one in Mara, the pizza. Mm -hmm. Who is the... I can't see the names. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Helen, Judy, Dave, Danny, Sam, Eve. Jason. Who is Eve? Eve. Ah. Uh, she, is, uh, she is the woman. She eating pizza. Um, and waiting near near Helen. Uh, near to Helen. Near oh, Helen. Uh -huh. near Helen. Okay. That one. Near. Say near Helen. Near Helen. Near near Helen. Helen. Mm -hmm. All right, you're doing a good job, guys. I'm gonna check other other. Okay. Lessons. Okay. Thank you. Welcome. Go ahead. Uh, Laura. <laughs> Laura, uh, yes. which one is Helen? Helen is the woman um, eating pizza. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh -huh. Gio, which one is Dave? Dave. Dave. Dave is the man with the white t-shirt and the hands on air. Dancing with the hands in the air. <laughs> Dancing with the hands in the air. Good job. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, over okay. here. Este, Sonia. Sonia. Hi. Este, <laughs> who is Sam? Que fíjate que no tengo la, la ah, pantalla. No. no puedo verlo. Ah. Y, y el celular se me descargó. Entonces no, no puedo ver. <laughs> ¿Qué está haciendo? Decime ah. qué está haciendo en español y yo te digo en inglés. <risa> es que se está comiendo un burrito, creo. Das no, ah, no. no. no tomando. No sé qué está, tomando está. Está ah, sí está tomando en el sofá. Eh, entonces sería he's, es, he's smoking in the. Está, está sentado tomando gasolina. Ah, <risa> drink. Uh -huh. Yo te vi fumando. No. Entonces, tomando. He's drink. He drinks in on this the sofa, no sofa, sofa sí. thing. On the sofa. On the sofa. On the sofa. Ah, sería como he's the one <laughs> drinking coca in the sofa. Coca Cola. No Coca Cola. Coke. 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 Cierto, Coke. Coke. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Ah, es que Sonia no puede verla. Pero... Sí, no bueno, lo veo también. y lo estoy okay. tratando de buscar acá, pero oh. sigamos. <laughs> Good job, guys. I'm going to leave the, the room and I'm going to visit someone else, all right? You're doing good. All right. Okay. Um, oh, and by the way, before I leave, try to use all of the options. He is the one, she is the one, he is the man, she is the woman, the people. Try to use all of them and do as many descriptions as you can. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. Who is Helen? Uh, the woman is eat a pizza. Eat a pizza? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh -huh. Pizza, I think that's what it has. Yes. For the form. Yes. Okay. 
Kevin, who is David? Dave. 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 Um, he's a man uh, dancing with Tom and Jody. Bonnie. Okay. Okay. Um, who talked to Helen, Bonnie? Helen. Uh, the girl one is wearing a glasses and her name is Evie. I nice. guess. <laughs> okay. Um JC. Yeah. Who's uh, let me see. Who is Danny? Who's Danny? It's a boy. Yes. <laughs> I I know. Know. Yeah. Okay. He's a he's the boy with. Uh, he's a boy. Quiero hacer una proposición. He's a boy. Sitting in the sofa. On, sitting on the sofa. Sitting on, on the sofa. Next sitting to Sam. Sitting on the sofa. <laughs> Next to Sam. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, Roxy. Who is, um, who is Claire? Claire. Uh, Chiboman is no sé cómo se dice riéndose laughing 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 okay Chiboman is laughing 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 ah laughing laughing me or the the Tom me or Tom okay 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 Kevin Tom. Who is Sam? Who is Sam? Sam is a man uh, wearing the uh, wearing 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 wearing, mm -hmm. wearing. purple shirt purple 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 shirt. How okay. do you feel the topic? Is this difficult, easy? Mm, I feel so. So, so. No, so, no, no less. So. We, need, we need more practice. But then. Go ahead and practice. I'm going to leave the, the rooms open for the next five minutes, and then we go back to the, to the main session, okay? okay? All right, keep it up, guys. Good job. On the sofa. Ah, uh, it's sobre on. On sofa and use the pants and yellow pants and t-shirt green with the yellow. Mm -hmm. And Pero green. Tiene que color. usar el verbo waiting. Waiting, waiting. waiting uh -huh. and de vistiendo. Uh -huh. Waiting the yellow, yellow pants. jeans. Uh -huh, fans, okay. uh -huh. t shirt Mariana and t shirt <laughs> red and yellow <laughs> and okay. sit on sofa. Okay, very good. Sitting on the sofa. On the sofa. Sitting on the sofa. Sitting on the sofa. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, who is Who is Eve? Xiomara. Eve. 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 Okay. She she's the woman. She wearing green green blouse. Blouse. Uh, blouse Blau, and blouse. eating pizza near Helen. Mm -hmm. 
very good. Um, who is Sam Moises? Sam, Sam, Sam. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, he's the man wearing uh, red pants and drinking soda. Wearing. Good job. Wearing. Yeah, but it's wearing. 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 Mm -hmm. wearing. Okay, thank you. Okay, let me see, let me see, let me see. Okay. Uh, but uh, Jorge, who okay. is who is Lucy? Lucy, 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 Lucy. Okay, Lucy is the woman uh, uh, next to Dave. Okay, uh -huh. doing good, doing good. In two minutes, I'm gonna close the room. All right. Okay. Okay. How are you doing, right? Who, huh? hmm. uh, who is uh, the woman wearing glasses? Steve. Steve. Uh huh. <laughs> Steve. And she's yeah, eating pizza. <laughs> And she's eating pizza. Mm -hmm. A weird who are, pizza. <laughs> who are the people dancing between lights? They, they, they are they. They, they and are Lucy. they. And Lucy and Jody. Judy. Yes. Laura, it's good to know that I can hear you. Te bueno saber que si la puedo escuchar, Laura. Antes no lo podía escuchar. So, welcome. <laughs> All right, fantastic. I'm going to close the room in one minute, okay? Okay. Okay. How do you say gorro? <laughs> Hat. Gorro. Hat. Is it the same como gorra? O sombrero. Yeah. You cap. Cap. Ajá, you can say cap and hat. Cap es como cachucha. Ajá. All right? Uh -huh. And hat, I'm sorry, can be like anything else. Hat como Ah, oh, ok. Ajá. Uh -huh. Everything else, perdón. Now, hay gente que le dice hat también a las cachuchas. Oh. Uh -huh. Aunque ya de, de, okay. de, de, de charro tipo Mexican, that's a hat, <laughs> not a cap. Oh, okay. All right. Very good, guys. Do you have any question? No. Make sure no. that if you have questions, we're gonna. I'm gonna close the rooms right now. We'll go back to the okay. main session, and I will try to answer your questions. All right. Okay. Right. Okay. waiting for people to come. All right, so I got Rotana, Sonia, Janira, and the rest of the people will be coming, okay. Very good, very good. People's coming, we're missing a few. All right, guys, so from the people that we, we are here already, Kevin, Rosanna, Ronnie, do you have any question about this topic? Oh, JC, hi, JC. Do you guys have any question about this topic? No. No, no? are you sure? Super <laughs> sure? <laughs> Yes. All right. Very good. Um, JC, were you able to practice? What? <laughs> were you able to practice? ¿Tuviste tiempo de practicar? No. No. Oh, 
Oh, oh. Faltó tiempo. Okay. Very good. So, guys, just to recap, we were able, to, well, today we learned on how to describe people based on their activities and their location. All right. Hoy aprendimos cómo identificar a la gente cuando no sabemos quién es, basado en sus actividades o dónde están. Okay. Yeah. Um, remember, practice makes perfect. En el ejercicio 13, prácticamente ustedes tienen dos oraciones. Y de esas dos oraciones tienen que hacer una. For example, Mary is the beautiful girl. That's one sentence. She is standing by the door. And we will say, Mary is the beautiful girl standing by the door. So, pretty much we make one sentence out of two sentences. All right? Tomorrow, the first thing that we are going to do is checking. Checking that exercise, all right? Okay. Very good. Are you sure you don't have any questions? Speak now or be quiet forever. No, you can ask tomorrow, right? But I would love to answer your questions right now. <laughs> no one? No questions? Are you sure? Yes. yes. Okay, los quiero ver en el knowledge check. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So, this will go for now. Finish. I want to say thank you very much for signing in tonight. Practice makes perfect. And believe it or not, English can change your lives. All right? So, All thank right. you very much. Keep doing your best. And this was another class with me, Alejandro Narbona, on behalf of Invest Corporativo. Have a good night, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Good night. 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 Take care. Bye. Okay, bye-bye.